Hello everyone and welcome to our exam B. In this video, we are taking the third question for the coding series. If you want to watch the previous videos, please watch the previous videos for the coding series in order to gain a better understanding for the questions which are very relevant for this FBIT. Now let's take the question and the question here is related to the algorithm and the level of the question is moderate. Let's take a look on the question. So the use case for the question is like you are a product manager and currently leading a team to develop new product. Unfortunately, the latest version of your product fails and quality checks. Since the version is developed based on the previous version, all the versions which are developed after the previous version, all these versions are bad and they will also be called as the bad versions. So what this particular question is saying that if you are going to develop a software, the software is having n number of versions. And if any one of the version in between is a bad version or let's say the development and the product is actually failing, all the developments which are happening after that version will be called as the bad version. Now what do you are going to do in this question you have to write a code in where you are going to find the bad version and if there is any bad version you just have to mark out the index for that particular bad version to do so you will be having an api support for bool is bad version which returns whether the version is bad okay so this particular question is not going to ask you to write the definition and the implementation for is bad version it you just have to write a function where you are going to just find the first bad version using is bad version function okay so this question i have taken from lead code and uh, you will not get the solution there i am providing you solution what you have to do you have to understand this particular question and you just have to go there and type this particular answer which i am giving to you in whichever language you want to code on currently i am giving it in c plus plus if you want to change the logic the logic will also work for python and java so in any version you want to have it you can just uh, uh, code in that particular language okay so one input output specification for this particular thing with an example is like input let's say we are having five versions and out of those five versions, the bad version, the first bad version is four. So I have to output four. Okay. So how I have to find the fourth one is bad. I have to write the logic for the same. Now, here you can see the API is bad version is defined for you already. So you do not have to actually write the is bad version. You have to utilize it bad version. And also you have to minimize the number of calls that are made to it bad version in order to reduce the time complexity of the system okay so let's uh, begin with the solution here i have made one extra method that is called as first bad version which is going to return you the version which is bad in the first time okay and you are having the number of versions in your parameter list which is represented by int n here now what you have to do you have to take a local variable where you are going to store the number of versions that you are having and after that just initialize the bad equal to one once you have initialized the bad equal to one, I'm assuming that the thing which is present uh, in the bad version is uh, actually bad. Okay, so what I am doing here, I'm just trying to negate the logic and checking that every time the bad index is less than n only. Okay, so now what I am doing here is I am just taking a while loop and I'm negating the logic of is bad version. So if there is any bad version, it will return true. If there is no, it will return false. And I'm negating the logic as per that only. I'll be explaining you how I'm going to implement this while loop. Is bad version. Suppose my first version is not bad. So this particular is bad version will return me false. When I'm negating the logic, it will be returning me as true. And bad should be less than n. It means the length uh, or the index to which I am iterating right now should be less than the number of functions that I'm having. If this is true, then I'm going to increment because I have not got my first bad version till now. Okay, after that thing, once this loop is going to have any kind of thing, either which is not true for the it bad version negation or with the bad less than n, I will come out of the loop and I will just return my bad index so that you will get to know which version is bad. So this particular question is the solution for the above mentioned question you if you want to have uh, like a coding or you want to do the coding on this particular question you can go to leadcode.com and there you can just try to code for this particular question you will have the api support for is bad version int version there only. okay so this was all for this question and we hope you like uh, and understand 
this particular video and uh, one announcement from our side is like we are having a monsoon sale which is giving you flat 40 percent off on all our online courses while using uh, the BEE 47 code you can just so you can gain these kinds of benefits from our uh, website you can enroll now and can get the benefit for this thing just use the code BEE 47 here if you like this video do hit the like button and if you are not a subscribed user for our program please do subscribe to our channel to get maximum updates in these remaining times for this FBI. Thank you. Keep practicing and stay updated.